Mookie Betts is a star, and David Price wants MLB to start treating him like it. 7 Takeaways from First Week of Sox Season For some odd reason, the 2018 American League MVP isn't featured in any of MLB's commercials despite being an elite player in one of baseball's biggest markets. Price expressed his frustration with MLB's marketing of bets, or lack thereof, to MassLive.com. OK, that's a joke. Price said, I saw the Brewers' first baseman, Jesus Aguilar, has a commercial on MLB Network. Great player, great player. I love watching him play. I've heard nothing but great things about him from Travis Shaw and all those guys. But he's not Mookie Betts. We're trying to grow this game in the African American community. Put that guy, Betts, on commercials. That's how this game grows. MLB is probably the worst at marketing their players. They need to do a better job of that. We've talked about that to the union and MLB commissioner, Mr. Rob Manfred many times, MLB's lackluster marketing of its players has been a subject of criticism for a while now, with Angels star Mike Trout being the prime example of the league's shortcomings. But Price emphasized that the issue goes well beyond just Trout. There's an entire group of worthy players blatantly being overlooked. Market the African American stars in baseball better, Price said. And the other players, everybody, market us better. Mookie Betts doesn't have a single commercial. He's one of the most marketable people in all of baseball. He plays for the Red Sox and he's African American. Zero commercials. A very likable person. He could be the face of baseball. And zero commercials. He just won MVP. MLB just needs to step up, Price's point is a valid one. There is no reason a player of Bats' talent and character shouldn't be promoted just as much if not more than players like Phillies star Bryce Harper, and that also goes for numerous other African-American stars around the league. Click here to download the new My Teams app by NBC Sports. Receive comprehensive coverage of your teams and stream the Celtics easily on your device. We're only nine games into the 2019 season, but frustrations already are boiling over for the Red Sox. Price criticizes MLB's marketing of bats. Rick Porcello got the starting nod for Friday night's game against the Diamondbacks, and it was a continuation of the rotation's struggles to begin the year. The fourth inning is when Porcello's night really started going downhill as the right-hander allowed four runs to give Arizona a 5-1 lead. After the inning finally came to an end, Porcello reacted appropriately, pick.twitter.com slash b8hd9 kawawap, Red Sox stats, at Red Sox stats, April 6, 2019 things didn't get much better from there. Porcello was removed in the fifth inning after letting up a solo home run to Adam Jones and a double to Alex Avila. He finished with seven earned runs on ten hits in four and two-thirds innings pitched. Click here to download the new My Teams app by NBC Sports. Receive comprehensive coverage of your teams and stream the Celtics easily on your device. The Boston Red Sox are going to give their starting pitchers an extra day of rest to close off their 11-game trip. On Sunday, Alex Cora is planning on starting lefty reliever Brian Johnson, but will wait until after Friday's game to make it official. Still waiting to see how it goes today. Cora said before Friday's game to Mass Live's Chris Cotillo. Brian Johnson, most likely. We've still got Hector, Velasquez. They can go multiple innings. We'll see how it goes, Johnson will take what would have been Chris Sale's place in the rotation. By giving Sale the extra rest that should give the Red Sox ace a chance to pitch in the team's home opener against the Toronto Blue Jays. Johnson has experience as a spot starter, and he started 13 games for the Red Sox last season. So far in 2019, Johnson is 1-0 and has allowed just one earned run in four and a third innings of work. Also, it's notable that ahead of Friday's game against the Arizona Diamondbacks, Johnson hadn't appeared in a game since the Sunday loss to the Seattle Mariners. So, he should be fresh if the team doesn't need his services in the next couple of days. Click here to download the new My Teams app by NBC Sports.
Receive comprehensive coverage of your teams and stream the Celtics easily on your device.